Yes, a win against Nikita Kirilov, who's ranked top 10, would uh, definitely uh, slingshot me and put me in a top 10 bracket myself and uh, right where I belong, uh, right where I always wanted to be and uh, in one year of time, in just uh, in my first contract, being able to reach such level in short amount of time, I'm very happy, all the training pays off. Yeah, this is a very exciting fight. Uh, people, some people that don't Nikita Krylov, uh, he's, a, he's a finisher, he knocks people out, he submits people, uh, he doesn't really go to decision like you said and uh, I'm pretty much the same way. We're very similar, yet a little bit different. So um, I don't think, I really don't think it's going to be a decision. Um, I don't really like to go to decision and let the uh, judges pick the winner. I, I don't believe in that. So I'll be pushing pedal to the metal and I'll be looking to finish the fight. This fight will start on the feet, we'll go to the ground, we'll get back up, we'll go to the ground, we'll strike, we'll kick. We're just gonna see who the better fighter is, you know? It's not gonna be uh, just like a one-shot kind of trick. It's not gonna be, it's not gonna be easy fight, basically. Uh, all the skills are gonna be put to the test. And uh, I expect a war. I expect a three-round war, but in a third round, I'm gonna be pushing hard pace like I always do, and I'll be looking to finish the fight. I, I, I wish all of you guys uh, tune in to December 10th in Toronto. It's gonna to be a huge fight. Um, check out my fight, don't blink. It's gonna be a great performance. All you fight fans, tune in.